Hello everyone and welcome to another modern video with the new cards. We have a ton of new cards in this deck and they're actually quite expensive. We got Nergoyf and Tamio. Thank you Daybreak for giving us this god account on day one, making our job easier. We got four Tamio, four Nergoyf, four Psychic Frog and three Arbinger of the Sea and I guess a little touch of Toxic Deluge as well. And also consigned to memory. This is another powerful card that's definitely replacing Anul in modern. Um, what do we got? How do you make a four power go if turn one? Uh, but maybe that's a little bit hard. Okay, on turn two, on turn two, you have to attack. You go bubble, then you go push and thoughtsies, boom, attack for a four five, because you have fetch land, bubble, push and thoughtsies. So, you know, that's power, powerful. Escape. Um, okay, so we got Psychic Frog, which is a card that is, uh, it's, it's an interesting card because the flow, like, it has a lot of pop potential, like, if the opponent doesn't deal with it, or doesn't have a flyer blocker, you just exalt three lands and connect and draw a card, and that's, and that's pretty good on a two minute one, two, that, I'm not gonna say it doesn't die to bolt, because if you bolt this, then you have to, like, to mind rot yourself, which isn't amazing. Uh, Tamiya is a card that I've played in blue-red, I've been very impressed there, so let's try it in this one. The mana base has one seeking to stupor, which is a card that has been showing up a lot, I'm mostly living Gen deck so far, but I expect this land to be going in every blue deck, in the same way as the Dota Wire was. This is my second league, and I'm ready to play blue-black frog. Should I play more swamps with a... no, one swamp is enough. Swamp is pretty bad in a deck with counter spell. Already playing one is uh is bad. What happened to Death Shadow? Mm, I'm I've never been a fan of Death Shadow. I was never really a shadow a shadow believer. Always more always liked more the blue red strategies. Although now with Nethergoyf, Orkish Bowmaster, you know, black is definitely getting very, very many powerful threats. So I'm trying to get to get into black again. Although I still don't like th that shadow card. Like for example, we just played a league with Burn. I played against another Burn, a Prowess, and uh, a Zoo. Like all these decks deal you so much damage that if you deal yourself ten, you just did. I don't know. I feel like it's good. Maybe the meta game is more controller. Even even then, they have Solitude. I think I'm off. I'm off that shadow. I'm glad if people play it and win with it, it's definitely a fun card, making interactive fun magic, but I just don't think it's very good. Frog can be good in Reanimator. Yeah, it's an enabler, you can discard your creature and reanimate it. I can see that, yeah. Well, Architects of Will, <laughs> interesting. <laughs> yeah. You don't like orcs. Okay. I I would never consider cutting orc. We are starting. We're on the draw. We don't have any companion. But what we have is Oh yeah, Shadow Titan, you're right. Ay uh ay 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 that's a, that's a bad thing of playing so many basics in a in a two color deck. <laughs> this hand is this hand feels like a draft hand, you know when you draw like basics of a color and spells of another color. Not not great, not a great feeling, I can tell you. It's like if you play Shadow, you can't play these lands, and this land is so good. You have to play only Shockland, Fetchland, Mana Base, which is so painful, I don't know. I guess I'm just not make for I'm not made for it. Lex, how did I do with Burn? I saw it 3-2, but we lost the mirror match. You next week in Pisa? Good luck in Pisa, I won't be there. I'll cycle immediately. I may draw like a push. Mm 
if they play that Mustard Pearl Trident. The classic bubble into bubble. Journey to Lock is a very discussed card. Oh, it kept a one lander. Let me try to go Psychic Frog. Let's see what happens. Hey, yo, old mate. It's going great. Very happy to play Magical Line. Today I'll be streaming three leagues instead of the Classic 2 and for the next days as well. Alright, I don't have I don't have island for island walk yet. Here's my second league. My two leagues on the uh, early access are on the YouTube channel. This is my second league uh, today with the new cards. First one was burned. Yeah, no cockatrice finally. Finally, I can deliver content on a platform. You know, though, I'm still doing Control S to shuffle my deck. Who is going to attack me? They don't. I'm bad. All right, let's think about this now. Psychic Frog. Okay, so what I can do is discard a card, like a Thoughtseize, and then exile three and attack. What do you think about this? What's my thought about Tamiya so far? This is my first game. I haven't drawn a card. You can, you can. Uh, not right now, Witty. I'm gonna do discard a card here, and exile three. Yeah, that's my plan. You would just attack. You say you would just attack. Let's think about it. Maybe you're right. I sh shouldn't do all that thing. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Let's just attack. I was just too much into the mindset of I need to draw a card, but I don't I don't need to draw a card. This thing doesn't do anything around the lock, remember. Okay, put it lets it go. I draw a card. I don't care about this carding one to do more damage. It's not a matchup that that, that cares about that. All right, so if I play Island, I, I think I have to play Island, uh, whatever. They'll, uh, they'll have Island walk. Um, I think I'll go Preordain. Yeah, drawing a lock now is pretty bad. I want to find, like, maybe Fatal Push. Not these. Not not good here. Pun is gonna go double lord. All unblockable. I don't have a removal spell. These granny locks are awful. It's funny because I showed this list to a friend yesterday and he said Granny Lock is unplayable. You shouldn't put it in your deck. And I'm like, nah, it's great. Literally first game. Drawing locks unplayable. <laughs> uh Oh wow, I can counter this. Sweet. You have a feeling that Drain Lock will end up on a ban list shortly. Yeah, maybe. I think they have another Lord. They put by on three, wow. If I'm my opponent have patch lines in their deck. No, I had a one stop. And if I draw push though, I like unlock my locks. I unlock my locks. All right, let's see what they put into play with Bio. Zviloon. Bobin, do you block? Please block. Woo! I didn't see on it. 
Attenzione chat. We may have found a ways to put our locks in the law. How did I find the new cards? By being a content creator. I have the Daybray underscore Mango account. So if I can find the new cards. And now let's just unload our hand, discard a card. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna discard everything here. I think that drawing the lock now is good. This is to all the haters at home for my poor drowning the lock. Boom! Psychic Frog, we are all in here. We put all our chips on the table and we are all in. <laughs> let's see, let's see if this, if they go Harbinger of the Tides bounce. No! <laughs> Uh, okay. Opponent has three cards in the graveyard. Now Drown is a removal spell. Ak. Kami is ready to be discarded. <laughs> All right. I don't, I don't need to get flying. If they want a uh, chum block, I'm happy, actually. Like a fro- Ooh, push! Madonna, what the fuck? All right. Go, Tamio. Make sure everything is fine from hand, please. Upkeep. I go push the Lord. Oh Lord. Two mana five six can get flying when it deals damage to a player draw a card. Not bad. You just have to discard four cards for it, yeah, you know? but once you do that <laughs> Oh, counter counter sauce. We can't counter. There are three drops in the time countable in two different ways. Mm, Bobby. Look at my drown in the lock, so versatile, so powerful, so good. Drown in the lock haters, this is for you. You at home. The Throne of the Drain was like one of the most powerful sets of all time. Every card from Throne of the Drain has a chance of getting banned. Drown in the lock. Rishadam Dog Hand, okay. Um, oh, look at this, look at this chat. I'm gonna go Tamio first. Madonna flip! <laughs> I flip Tamio. Allora, uh, let's give this frog flying. Una, due. Yeah. Man, when the first game of the video is this exciting, it's always, uh, it's always good. It's great for attention. From a second card, give me, give me froggy, give me, give me. Then we play Preordain and flip Tamio. One mana planeswalker, ladies and gentlemen. Plus two. Let's push as well. I mean, Frog didn't just draw three cards. It also killed this V-Loon. Okay, so, you know. I'll uh, open a small window as a ex-professional player and not content creator. 
Well, the truth is that my opponent probably didn't play very well. If they just ignored my thing and did their thing, I would have lost this game. Close the parenthesis. Thank you, opponent, for playing this way so that I could showcase the power of new cards. Woo! Now, we have Toxic Deluge and probably also a Stern's Golden. Dress Down? Hmm. Dress down, uh, it's, not, it's not great with Nether Goeth, but I feel like you gotta accept this downside when it happens. Okay, what cards are bad? Well, in every matchup, draining the lock? No, never mind. Um, Orcish Bowmaster is probably bad? Yeah, I'll take this out. Uh, let's cut one, draining the lock. Sir scolding against Cavern of Souls. Actually, maybe Counterspell is worse than Drown. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Show me Cavern. Counterspell probably like sucks big time. I think, honestly, anything is better than Counterspell. Probably even Orc is better than Counterspell. Yeah, scolding, scolding is good. I know they have Cavern of Souls and Vial, but whatever. Like, when you change one mana for two or three, it's it's worth it. Hello, Yefiem. Welcome. And Sinimi. Welcome, guys. I love to read the first message in the chat. It's always a nice it's always a nice thing. Oh, we have the new polluted delta art, which they make sure. Let's talk let's talk about let's talk about artworks a little bit now. Let's talk about artworks a little bit now. So, you know, I, I like all the cards and everything, but honestly, the Polluted Delta old art was. Oh no, never mind. The Flooded Strand old art sucks. Yeah. The Flooded Strand old art is something that I always wonder like, what is this? You know? I guess Polluted Delta old art is not, is not too bad. No, it's. It's. I guess it's. Oh. But it's not the new art is better. Like, I think it, it looks like a, a store with old boxes of magic. It doesn't look like a polluted delta. Do you want to see a polluted delta? You can just take pictures of rivers in the world. That's probably a more. Uh... Oh, look, I got lands and spells. Keep. Sorry, opponent, for making you wait. I had to digress a little bit. Windswept Teeth is the worst. Let me see, let me see. Let me see, I don't remember. I spent that team on you. I gotta wait a little bit more opponent. Windswept Teeth, I'm 100% mis... No, wow, I didn't. Oh, no. oh, it's beautiful. Oh, you mean damage 3-1? Yeah, this is like, whatever. Like, mm, 2000, 2024 arts, you just... You can just go on a computer, you write planes with things on top. Boom. Here's my picture. No, I like Wins of Teeth. Oh, the new art. Yeah. Whatever. New art. New art is whatever to me now. New art, you just gotta to play it. Okay. Uh, well, we have the combo. We have the combo. And she's to the Mango Cube. Unfortunately, there's just way too much stuff for me to do these days. I'm not cubing. I'm not thinking about cube. Too many formats to follow. Today, I'm going to go to the Mango's Workshop. We're going to play pre-modern. <laughs> What's the combo? Uh, Tamio Bubble. That's a combo. You bubble, crack, end of turn, untap. Draw. Attack. Make a clue. I think I want to go preordain instead of a uh, 
cracking the clue. Much less mana. And the Primordium deck you're looking for with MH3. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, it's fine. But Primordium videos do well. We keep on doing things that do well. Let's hope they don't touch the Tamio. Nice. I think I'll bottom a frog. Thank you, I got enough frogs. And then we flip our Planeswalker. Turn two, Planeswalker. Easy game. Uh, do I want to play a creature? Yeah. That's a very big creature. It's one mana three four. I guess this 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 screenshot is even better. You gotta turn two. I have a four loyalty planeswalker and a three four. <laughs> this is so powerful. It's unbelievable. It's unbelievable how powerful it is. All right, what you do there? Okay, so Arbinger of the Seas. Forty eighth. I forgot I had the sub sound on. It, it you woke me up. Thank you, forty eighth. Losing this game now, man. I'm losing this game now. Make a new screenshot. No, the screenshot needs to only be attractive. I can't make a screenshot that's negative. Unless it's a fun negative. But Magus of the Moon isn't fun, so isn't fun when you receive it. It's only fun when you make it. I'm not making it. One of the few matchups with plus one two having is relevant. Few matchups? What do you mean? Few decks play creatures in modern. I need to fetch for swamp. Did I? I don't know. I guess. I guess I did. I mean, I've, I don't have counters for my deck. Yeah, I fetch for swamp. No way to lose this game. Well, let's hope they don't have a way to kill my Tamio. Bro, half of my deck, hopefully there's a swamp in it. Oh, Marsh Flats, I can fetch a swamp. Oh, I'm the city sewer. I can surveil a swamp. All right. Well, pass. No, Tizana. Cazzo. My Tamiya doesn't have text anymore. Ripperoni. I can't believe I lost this game. I had like the nuts. And only because I didn't fetch a swamp, I lost this game. No. Daniel, why, would, why didn't we fetch a swamp? Why? 
Oh, God. So, all right, next game. Next game we will. Next game we're fine. This is why Richard Garfield gave you three games. Because he can punt one away and still win. Richard taught, taught about everything. Can you give me a swamp? Swamp? Do 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 Um, basta, basta così, dai, va bene. Ah, uh, no, not yet. Let's see, let's see. Let me get draw swamp. Which one? Sorry, it's the three. Okay. Swamp? Classic. I don't even know what I would have done with Swamp, to be honest. All right. Yan GG. Okay. Chow, what happens if I draw a dress down when there's Magus into play? My land is still island, right? Yeah, it's the same thing as Dress Down and Magus. Yeah, I thought so. All right, we have the we have the the super combo, and we even have fetch for swamp opponent. Col cazzo che questa mi puli porca Eva. We got we got marsh flats. I can't lose this game. Bubble, uh, Bo Isla, Tamio. Double bubble. Let's hope they don't have this member for my Tamio. This is like Splinter Twin, though. Tamio and Bubble is Splinter Twin. Draw two. I don't know why I fetch. I don't know why I played Island though. That's a, no, in draw step. Oh, maybe it's a mistake though. Yeah, maybe I made a mistake here. Actually, yeah, I should have definitely. Okay, I made a lot of mistakes. That man, good thoughts, eh? Let's not punt this, because I actually, my hand sucks. I'm going to lose this game. So I need to play tight. Allora. Should I play Watery Grave on turn one? Because obviously my turn two could have easily been like Survey Land, Net or Goif, which now I can do. Um, No rush into Fetching Swamp. It can't happen now. So I guess I can go Dark Slick Shore, Net or Goif. Next turn, we must fetch Swamp. Let's not forget about it. Cavern of Sauce. Tide Shaper. Oh, Kaboya, yeah, Tide Shaper. Actually, Tide Shaper is a way to break my Swamp. Psychic Frog. Okay. All right, what if I go... Yeah, I think I'm gonna go push here. And then frog. Because otherwise I can't. I can't double spell. Maybe I don't care. 
Uh, I think I do care. Push frog. Tick up. Attack. Frog's great now. My hand sucks. I just load it on the frog. Just put it on the frog. My hand on the frog. Thank you. Take three here. Oh, they're doing something. What is it? Rashada Dark Hand. It's got combos with the enchantment that makes tokens when you tap a thing. Although they don't really play that anymore. Yeah, Frog would carry us this game. I mean, this game we had a combo of Swamp plus cards. Once we achieve that combo, a Merfolk, Merfolk player can't do anything about it. Oh, John Daniele. Thank you. Sorry, opponent. I got my basic land. Dockhand has island walk, but my Tamiyo made sure it has no power. I'm not gonna attack with Nether Goy. If I know the top of the deck is Merfolk Trickster. Dark Nakato. 30 euro Dark Nakato. Honestly, I even saw this card for less than 30 euros. Like 25 euros. It's a mythic rare. I think it's... Yeah. I think it's good. Is Tamiya really good? Oh, you tell me. It's a one mana planeswalker. Doesn't seem that bad. Interaction? Removal spell? Nanta Terra. Va bene! Oh, uh, so. I'll just go to combat. I'm not gonna use Tamu now. We think Ralph Valley will go down or be stable. Mm, I don't know about that. I don't even know how much it is. I'm not interested in Storm. Purple Trickster, okay. You tap my frog. Okay. What do you do with the Goyf? I think I'm still scared of it, like another Trickster. So I'm just gonna not attack now. I'll plus Tamyo. Next turn, it's like right now, it's lethal. Like, I have lethal next turn. I have lethal next turn. If I trade Necro, I'm not that high on Necro. I haven't played much with it, I have to say. You know, my Cockatrice gameplay, whenever I played it, it wasn't good. But I haven't played against it or with it enough to say if it's good or not. The stats tell you... No, sorry, not the stats. Reading the card tell you that's insane, but playing with it, it hasn't impressed me. Before the can Tishana. I need cats or something. I need Tishana. Faint! Thank you for the prime sub. Welcome to the stream. If they Tishana by my Tamio, that's when I care, not about the fetch land. If they, they Tishana by fetch land, I'll be happy. Thank you, Faint. Welcome, welcome. It left Tishana, so it's not that I'm gonna just go, like, oh yeah, minus seven. I can't, I can't like, you know, I have thoughts in my deck. Is there a ranking system on MTGO? No. There's like a trophy leads, trophy leaderboard. So Zompatanfo, wow, what a name, uh, has two trophies in one day. That's pretty great. <laughs> I sold on Ergoif. Man, this is my first match. I'm not sold on anything. I'm only sold on Tamiya because obviously you read this card and it's broken. Nergoif, I mean, I know it's a 1 mana 3 4, a 1 mana 4 5, but. Stats nowadays don't matter on cards anymore. 
It's about what they do, not the stats. It doesn't matter how big it is. It matters how you use it. For magic cards. Okay, you're tapping bio. Okay. Trickster. All right. So they can bump down my Tamio to seven. Because Tamio made uh, makes everything a minus one minus O. Oh. The Jace Architects of Will ability. No, Jace Architects of what? Of thoughts? Yeah, of thoughts. Wow, they don't have Tishana. Hello, Siva. How much? How much? How much are we gonna draw here? I don't know, I can't count, but thankfully we play Magical Line. They don't have Tishana? That go if it's a safe buy. What's a safe buy? Oh, even a school diabet. What can they do? Nothing. They can't do anything. Oh, Bowmaster. No, what are you talking about? Yeah, Bowmaster is good, though. All right. That's Thoughtseize. And then I one shot with Frog. Hope opponent lets me do it. Oh, they conceded. We were going to win with Psychic Frog plus Tamio Emblem. Tamio Ultimate. That, yeah. Alright, if you play against Merfolk, make sure to fetch Basic Land. Don't make them win like this. Don't make them win like this. Screenshot secured, exactly. One mana Planeswalker. One mana Planeswalker. I still need to buy two Tamio. Does anyone have uh, two Tamio to sell me? I only, I only own two. Yeah, Frog, uh, Frog was amazing this match when I could cast it. No one talks about the Frog Tamio combo? Man, if you're drawing half of your deck, that's not a combo. You won already. If you draw half of your deck and you lose, you should put the one half and also the other half directly in the garbage bin. That's time for you, Spuzz Kittles. Good night. You'll find this video out tomorrow, which is Wednesday. No, sorry. Tuesday. No, my cat's Thursday. Is it better to run three Tamio? Yeah, if you can't afford the fourth one, it's better. But if you can, play four. What do you think about Tamio in Izzet Wizard? I think literally any deck that plays Basic Island should have Tamio. They made a one mana Planeswalker. The, they, they, they couldn't push this card harder. Below one, there's only zero, you know? Okay, do I want to go Basic Island with this end? Because I don't know the matchup. The Pen Sword. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll go Island. Hmm, Mishra's Bubble. Flooded Strand, okay. What's this? Oh, Merc died. Okay, interesting. All right, it's going to be a fun matchup.
Ragaban. And here you see why I cut Ragaban from my deck. Let me introduce you to this friend called Orkish Bomanzo. Which is a card that unfortunately pushed out this card, which used to be called Ragaban because people were so good they need to ban it. Guess what? Doesn't make my 60 anymore. This card are still uh, reasonably priced. You should probably try to trade them. That'd be a good improvement. Alright, I missed the land. Split thoughts is taking iteration. No. I think I have to take Merc Tide. I don't have an answer for it yet. Preordain. And the thing with time is that isn't it isn't just a one mana planeswalker. It also like it's a late game. It's a late game engine. Do you find another Merc Tide? No, you found the Tamiya, okay. And the Perdis, you're gonna flip your one mana planeswalker. Jealous. Jealous of you opponent. I wish you can also flip mine. I think I need to I need to push Tamio down of loyalty there. She needs to go to two loyalty now. There's always a flim of anor, man. But flim, I I don't know about flim of anor. Still, I'm scared of putting three drops in my deck. Putting three drops in your deck is a big ask to your modern deck. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. With time you're getting grinding station, yeah. Time you mix making clue makes the Urza saga bigger. All right, they have island. They have island. What does that mean that they have island? Do you think it means something? They're shocked with the island. They must have something. I can't do anything here. I have to pass, unfortunately. Oh, Madonna. Alright, my opponent brought back minus three, then brought back Anoli Heat. Okay. Like time you're with Ragavan. I don't know, I'm just afraid that you can't have too many... Too many one mana card. Maybe you can. But like, Channeler is a better of both, probably. When you play Tamiya, your hand is unholy heat. I think it's fine. Just draw a card of Clue here. Yeah, they must have Spell Pierce. Yeah. Blend. Ah, I can tilt that blend. Okay, okay, that's fine. I'll play top land frog here. Oh no! Could have killed Tammy if I tapped with all. I forgot. Ah, che cappella. Chat, I punted. I'm sorry. I forgot that sh this was minus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big punt here. I'm gonna lose the game because of it. I'm gonna blame the huge fly that came into my room making infinite noise. That left. I don't even know where it is. Ay ay ay. Big punt, big punt. Point of steals and only heating end that they that they bounced. Well, could have killed Tamio there. Maybe Point could have flipped it again, but maybe not.
I'm gonna play Echovions. Echovions was my preview card with MH1. Love it. All right, gonna go preordain. Yeah, find a man. Both of these cards are good. How big is the regent? Not too big. How big is ah? Se tornata dio caro. Così grossa. Uh, how big is the nettergoeth? One, two, three. Not too big. Not too big, not too big. Allora, facciamo così, facciamo. Bottom, top. Do I want to crack a clue? I will. If you use a Nodi Heat on Tamio, I'm okay with it. Yep, you do. Okay. Drop. Thoughts easy. No, I'll play Nergoyf. Pass. Invert polarity. Ay ay ay. Or do they flip? They lost the flip. Okay. It was just a counter spell. Ragavan sideboard, you mean he Merc died? I don't know. You just play Merc died now? I can still run in the locket, so I will. I mean, I played around spell because of the whole game. Maybe they just never had it. Maybe they just never had it. Let's try to see if they had it. I guess they don't play it if they had it, so. It doesn't matter. Eh, 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 eh. Do I play Thoughtseize? And discard that spell Pierce. Nah, two life matters for sure. Play Nergoef. Keep attacking this Tamio. They can now go like minus three to Tamio, flip the next one. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose this game. Lost this game to Tamio. Lost this game also to mistake. But yeah, the, the Tamio is very good. They also, they also have like infinite clues now. Oh uh, look, I guess I can ping the Tamio so it doesn't flip. So it doesn't minus. Alright. Well my opponent will think about their big brain turn, I'll F6 and go to the bathroom. Alright, my opponent just ticked up Tamio, attacked and passed, that's it? Nothing else? Huh. Alright. Uh, attack? Maybe I should have kept that Mark tied. Do I keep on attacking Tamio? Or... Or do I change target? Of my anger? Yeah, I think I'm attacking face this time. I changed target. They block. And they take three, got a six. Oh, wow. You chump block. Man, what do you have in end? I pass here. Wow. Draw card again. Uh, do we want to go face or Tamio? I'll go face. Let me ignore Tamio now. What if they just land tapped? But I kind of also want to bounce Channeler. I think I should do it. Ah, they wanna okay, I see what you mean. They want to attack and minus three on bolt. Yeah, I guess I lose to that. Alright. 
Let's try to... I guess not, they have Spell Pierce. Yeah, Spell Pierce the whole game, so I'm not gonna play into it. Yeah, I should've played this land top, my bad. They have counterspell in it. Sorry, they have um bolt in end. Yeah, it's fine. I'll just I'll draw. If they have bolt and pierce, I'll lose. But I feel like I I need to do something. All right, this game we made a ton of mistakes. We definitely should have won this game in a lot of ways. I feel like now. The game was just over. All right, let's hope I can win the rest. On the play. The horse burn, we went three and two. We lost the mirror match, so three, one. <laughs> Actually, everything looks solid. I don't think I wanna side out anything from this deck for the mirror match just pull up drown for bomb just because it's the worst card of the deck although obviously the point of plays removal spells so I can just kill Tamio I have to crack the bubble just yet. When it kills this now, I just hold the bubble for next turn. Hope they're in a bolt, but they have annoy heat instead. I'll definitely crack the bubble if they have bolt. Uh, well done. See. All right. Uh, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'll uh, crack, crack the clue, and if they have bolt, it's okay. Still happy with the trade. I take watery grave. My hand is very black and blue. All right, we flip time, you'll turn two. Oh my, that please walk or draw hard. Not bad. Um, I think I'm gonna go swamp so that play around. Uh, I guess they can't have blood moon in if they play blood of strand. Uh, sorry, Magson, oh, whatever. Uh, let's play thoughts is first. Okay, so what if? What if I take Anori Heat? Then I minus three Tami, I'll get back Thoughtseize. Play Thoughtseize on Merc. And then I play Netagoif, which they can't counter because it's a 3 4 for one mana. Is this the new grief? Yeah, I guess. Put in Drew Channeler. Okay. A 
they preordain. I don't want Thoughtseize. I don't even want to work, I think. Uh, yeah, playing bounce spell sucks, but maybe I'm okay with it. I just bounce attack for four. Not sure if this is a good play. It's like a minus Tammy again and just cash in my value. Brown, okay, not bad. Um, mm, yeah, I'll just take up attack, maybe the double block, and then I'll play ground in a uh, whatever, it doesn't matter. Another full end, so just kill and pass. I just don't want to, yeah. Okay, just like the first match, we punted one, but we have two more to win. So, you know, it's all right. It's me, Wally. Thank you for the fourth month. Welcome. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Thank you, thank you. Scolding too narrow. Unfortunately, if you look at the deck, everything is too good, I think. Maybe maybe Drown is better than Counterspell. So I should just kick Counterspell instead of Drown. I would like to kick Frog so far. It was good in the previous match. In this match, I never drew it. Ay ay ay, they have Tamio. Okay, thank god they don't have the, the bubble. Basically, Tamio plus uh, bubble is like Sword in Vein Ripper. It's the same. Well, next turn, I can't kill Tamio. What about this turn? What do I do this turn? Is just play my Tamio? I think so. Unfortunately, I also don't have the bubble. Yeah, ERC bubble. Still Amazing opening from my opponent. I think I'm just killing Tamio Pass. That's my play. Uh, I guess I can go Swamp and then I can go Island. Definitely a matchup where a life total may be irrelevant here. Yeah, I'm grateful for, for drawing the lock. Drawing the lock haters, I don't want to hear you. Wow, that's your turn? Just crack a clue? Okay, we're in business. Man, perfect. Your thoughts is I can even go mark that if I want to. Let's see. Wow, what a hand! Hello.
I think I want to take Merc Tide. Then I want to fetch an island. Play Spell Bomb. And play Nerekoeth. Which is threatening to be a 5 6. My opponent doesn't have Delirium at the moment. And even if they get there, I can crack the bubble. One mana, five, six. Right, so they start with draw step and then an only heat here. Surveil one. They don't have the Lyrum, so this is just two damage. They play Lightning Bolt. I'll let you surveil and then I crack the bubble. And this becomes a 5-6. Boom. Pum. Pum! Spaccato! One mana 5-6, by the way. Amio. Strong. What do I do now? The thing is that Tamio doesn't die to a Noli Heat. I don't want to resolve my Merc. Obviously, the Goif will become a 3 4. Nah. I only have one Merc. That's the tiny little Nombo that's in this deck of Goif plus Merc, but I only have one Merc. Yeah. Okay. Let's draw a cantrip or you concede. Okay. All right. So second match in a row where I heavily punt one of the two games. Sorry, one of the three games, but thankfully we managed to win the whole match. This is always the lesson of magic and uh, to just try to Take away the negative mindset of, oh, I punted a match. A game, sorry. Because you, you have two more. Every time, you have two more. If I put a bolt with push and drown, and drown is nice. Drown? Very good. Counter spell and removal spell, all in one card. Don't let the haters tell you otherwise. You got an ad for Barilla Pesto. Barilla Pesto, what does it mean? Does Barilla also make sauces? I guess. Does it? I mean, I guess you just saw the ad, so you can tell us. Alright, this hand is a mulligan. This hand is awful, but I'm keeping it. Bottom Orc, I'm playing as a Giganta deck. Usually Giganta deck aren't weak to Orc. Yeah, yeah, I understand, I understand. I just didn't know they made sauces, that's it. I guess, I guess, I guess they do. So you can buy the pasta and the sauce, you don't need an additional branding. Desperate Ritual on top of their deck. Okay. All right, drew the swamp, noise. Desperate Ritual and they kept it too. The starting ritual. Ral. Ah, so. Ah, oh, look at this push. I'm just gonna zero. It's turn two, my opponent is going. It's turn two, my opponent has started their journey.
Da -da 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 All right. Meanwhile, I'll uh, sort the things that for my for my burn video coming out. Uh, burn. Let's save the thumbnail. Burn gets even better with MH3 is going to be my title. Could have been a more clickbaity title. But I'll sit with that. All right, my opponent has finished the turn. What did I do? What did you do, opponent? You didn't do anything? When can you cast this? Reckless Impulse is not bad. Alright, I guess I want to counter Reckless Impulse. They didn't lose every flip, they win flip, they just don't flip their RAL. Honor. They won a flip. It's a May RAL. F6 again. Okay, where are we now? You have a uh, boat. I'm just gonna uh, play my cards and pass. My turns are easy. You have the big brain deck, opponent. My turns are easy over here. What did you do? Nothing. Rub medallion go. Okay. Tack. Eh, what if I pass here? Just keep up drown. Nothing happens. I draw for clue. Yeah. Return Giganta. Okay. Maybe this deck needs to play 20 lands. Because we don't have expressive iteration to hit land drops. Thoughtseize. Attack. I just keep on doing the same gameplay. Just keep a counter and and we won't lose. Yeah, I just every end of turn, I draw a car with Tamiyo. No rush. Don't even need. I, I don't even want to flip Tamiyo in, in a game like this. Past in flames. This looks like a card I have to counter. Thankfully, my opponent can't recast it immediately. So 
Very important that I kept up counter every turn, otherwise, uh, would have lost. Casting planes. I play Psychic Frog. Yeah, flashbacks reduced, so that they have to pay four now to flash it back. I'll, I'm, I still got a counter. Fetch Island here. This definitely looks like a matchup where they can deal like a finite amount of damage, not an infinite. I don't even know if that's something you say in English. Okay, you drew Reckless Impulse as well, and you flipped ay 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 ay. Next turn, they have again Past in Flame, so I need to find a. I guess I can minus Tamio and get back a counter. All right, you pass. So, oh wow, I drew a counter spell. Nice. I'll discard the uh, Thoughts to Frog. I'll um, crack a clue first. Why? Yeah, because I may want to just put it on the frog. Let me think about this. Do I need two counters this turn? My opponent tops three. Yeah, I guess if they draw land, they need two counters. So first I should just see what I draw and then I'll decide. Time has been very good. Oh, master. Yeah, we should draw off a clue here. Unfortunately, I can't... Uh... Does Bowmaster do anything as my opponent? I guess they have minor foes, but it doesn't look like it does something. Leolisan, thank you, thank you. All right. I'll flip Tamio. And Brie Black. Thank you. Good morning. I'll flip Tamio because next turn I need to bring back a. An extra I need to bring back a removal. Sorry, a counter spell. Because this turn I can counter that. Next turn I have to counter that again. Okay. They drew a ritual, so I think I die. Yeah, I think I die. Thank you guys for supporting. Welcome to the stream. Uh, is there a reason for me to counter this? Am I dead if I if I let this resolve? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. One. Two, three, four. Maybe I should just counter another unstable amulet. I think I should let this resolve because they have a parasitic ritual in end. So if I counter this, they just go one mana ritual. Tap two more land. Tap one more land. Flash it back, and I lose regardless. The only I cast Ral uh, on paper on magical land. You can't cast Ral with passing flames. Uh, I'll let this resolve and let's see what happens. Yeah, flipping the second past in flames was probably the, the only way I could have I could have had to lose. Alright, there are casting rituals from the graveyard. Yeah, I think my, my, my only hope is that they don't deal me, as I said earlier, an infinite amount of damage. But only a finite and I don't die off of it. Maybe I should have just had Orcish Bowmaster, because they could have given me lethal next turn whereas now maybe i don't have lethal anyway but i guess if they if they brick i i will regardless we'll see 
Okay, they they drew Ral. Now, what does this do? I have to counter this. Why not counter it? It has flashback, so I could have cast it regardless. If I counter the first passive limbs, it's like only attacks of four mana, which doesn't matter. They have infinite, they have infinite mana anyway this turn. Okay, so what does Ral do to me? It has a flashback, I guess. The flashback has minus two, it deals three damage divided as you choose. It's not an ability. Minus eight, is that a top card? Mm. The ultimate of Ral doesn't do anything. If their weak condition is unstable amulets. No? Draw eight. It's not draw eight. It's much worse than that. Grape shot. Aspirin Spike wasn't playing Grape Shot when I saw his uh, when I saw his stream. People always pick Spike list. I'm gonna take a line where I only counter unstable amulets. Take a line where I only counter unstable amulets. We'll see. I think this is the only the the way they kill me. So. Ral just helps in a game that is uh, not even here anymore because they already have a. They already have like infinite mana, basically. I probably just dying regardless, but like they only have you know they usually got seven spells. Yeah, seven spells not that many. Yeah, they flip Ral now. Why not counter passing flames? It has the ability to flashback. Let's see what it flipped. Oh, glimpse the impossible. Oh, a two glimpse the impossible. I think now it's over. Okay, GG. They can easily cast seven spells now. Yeah, maybe we should have counter Ral. Okay, okay, okay. GG. Consent to memory, what does this do? Counter target triggered ability. Hmm. Bosses 2 doesn't even do much if you think about it. It's not that they have store. I don't I don't think this was a punt. Uh, anyway, um, I think Orc is bad. I would just side him all out. I'll side like this. Yeah, the the, the passive flames. I mean, I play, they flipped the third passive flames. So they play. They showed me at least three passive flames. I guess they play. They play four passive flames. Powerful card. Consign? What do you kind of with consign? Ah, uh, yeah, this one sucks. All right, this one's good. I'm sorry, Nada Goeth. Should probably use Marsh Flats. All right, I wish I can. She could count it that one. Uh, I'm gonna go fetch Island for your name. Holding up Scolding for Ral. Attack for two. Thoughts is push. Strong. I'll leave both on top. That's why you fetch with preordain before casting it. So if you leave both on top. It attacks me for one. I got a 15.
they pass, all right. I'll push. It's a 3-4 now. Draw Thoughtseize, which I play before combat. See what you got. Yeah, go with uh, one one Lacaro. See what you got. Veil of Summer. I don't know. I can't let I can't let you have that. I cannot let you have that. I have five cards. Could have gone for the Aruba Medallion as well. Let's see, they play land first. That means they want to go, I'm assuming, Ruby into uh, Re Impulse. Oh, wow, you went Ruby into a Ritual. Huh. You drew in Stable Amulet, okay. Okay. Alright, so you have two Ritual next turn, you have no cards in hand. Perfect. It's bold not to take Ruby Medallion. I mean, I have to make a decision. I can either go for the mana or for the um, cards, and I decide to go for the mana, because the card can find more mana. And they pass. Stress Golding doesn't do too much, but I cut Orkish Bowmaster, which I think is also like a pretty bad thought since they have no cards in end. Alright, well, got nothing to do. I'll attack. They have also nothing to do, so let's see if they top deck past in flames like the previous game, or they just die with a bunch of Ruby Medallions in play. I hope they die. <laughs> no, actually, Giganta, they can cast it this turn, and it's gonna be huge. Yep, Giganta, definitely gonna be huge here. Can they cast it? Are we managed to pick it up? It costs three mana. They need they need a land to cast Giganta. No, you drew past the inflames. Alright, I guess I die. GG. This just spells uh this just spells always worse than counters against combo decks. I guess we needed a Psychic Frog or mer more Merc Tides to have a shorter clock. We can play more Nihil Spell Bomb. But yeah, that's true, we can put Dothy. I got Shadow, mm, I don't like that card. You think Tron can go back in meta? Oh, Tron was always in meta, no? Tron is just a good deck. Okay, hmm, thinking about this. I just want to go probably both Nether go of turn one and no Thoughtseize. I'm going to start the beat. Force of Negation? Yeah, that's true. Force of Negation, Exhaust Past in Flames. May not be a bad idea. All right, um, don't think I want to draw another bubble. I'll just get a Watery Grave and play Shadow. Uh, go if sorry. Hello, Slinger. Yeah, the past in flames, uh, the top of the deck were good, but I mean, it is what it is. When you play a Thoughts' is deck, you have to get ready to the opponent top deck. Otherwise, you play another deck. All right, my opponent has the Devour of Destiny ability in upkeep. Is Mono Blue Tron better than Green Tron? That 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 answer of that question will probably always be no. Like Green just has uh, you know ancient steering, Sylvan's crying. So I don't know what they need to be for making Blue Tron better than Green Tron. Alright, they exile three cards. 
the virus in the island or Nithopter. Interesting deck that plays both of these cards. Ooh, where's the saga? Okay. Springlip Drum. Okay. And Memnite. You have anything else? No. Okay. Well, if that's Affinity, uh, Bowmaster is very good against it. So my hand is like mono black. I, I'm probably fine with going um, basic swamp here. I'll play Orc, which is good against Thoughtcast and Thought Monitors. Could have also gone push Thoughtsis, but I kind of want to keep push if they have the, the land that gives two mana, the Ugin's Labyrinth, which combos with Urza Saga. They don't have it. Yeah, like if you watch my video, I'll tell you how it's too risky to go. Or is this like a turn one if you don't have a second zero mana creature? Because now opponents are going to waste their... I mean, not waste, but... At least they'll make one construct. Yeah, I don't like that play that they did. Like, it... Let me see their hand first, but like... They could have just gone like turn two Saga. I would have just died to it very easily. Alright, how do we attack? Okay, we're trading like this. I want to reduce their number of artifacts, and this does do that. But they can do a construct and give it haste, but at this point, like again. Like if you're a affinity player, definitely watch my definitely watch my videos where this question this sequence comes up a lot. Run in the lock, besto cardo. So good, so versatile, so beautiful. One mana five six, by the way. Although I felt like it would have. I would have perished to Urza Saga this game. Alright, we have Dress Down, Harbinger of the Seas. What else do we have? This is the first time I said this in today. Probably one Toxic Deluge as well. Consent to Memory. I don't think I want Stern Scolded, but maybe I do. Well, then there's a lot of cyber cards, so we must keep it. That's how it works. Esto cardo. That's running the lock right there. All right, so we have a turn two Planeswalker. Although my opponent 
has a, an unfair strategy. They don't play just creatures. God, so I thought this was Dark Slick Shore. Sorry. All right. Man, this is this that in paper and usually a magical line too. I have the other art of Dark Click Shore. I got got by the your cat. They don't even look that similar. Okay. Is it maybe really being a mulligan then? All right. Let's see if they have Ugin's. Uh, I know. I got lazy. I only changed the. Uh, I only changed thoughtsies. They gave me the the Theros thoughtsies, and I changed it. Everything else, I got lazy. Just play with the thing that <laughs> that the the magical end gave me. All right, now they can make construct, and I probably just die to it. So we'll see. Eh, die yet? Let's go, uh, Tamio. Take a construct, I'll push it, and then we'll see what happens. I'll take, I'll take a swamp here. I need to put a stall. And kill this with basic swamp. Ay ay ay, Kappa Cannoneer on top of the deck. I guess that's why we have Toxic Deluge. Because otherwise you can't kill that thing normally. Because that word for... Word for... It's literally X-proof. I guess only Solid should can kill this thing. There's no source to Plowshare or Red Elemental Blast in the format. So in Modern, for one mana... What are your sources of killing this thing for one mana? Oh, Leland Binding, true. All right. I guess you can do five mana binding. That's reasonable. Yeah, I'm so in love with Toxic Deluge. It's like, in cube is so powerful and, you know, people play Domination and such. I know the heat, right. I know the heat as well. Yeah, for sure. Shield Ray Edict? Uh, Tammy has felt, uh, has felt great today. We even like... We had a game where we... We won... With Tammy minus And Psychic Frog in play To pump the frog and kill my opponent. Oh yeah, so far Tammy is definitely was definitely good. Alright, they played uh Canoniera. It's alright though. Woo, it's alright though. Is it right? Yeah. Think about this. All right, I can go toxic the illusion. They how, how greedy do I want to be? Because I can also just flip Tamio. I die. I don't. Die va bene. Let's go for the greedy line of uh attack. You know, get me killed? How though? How do I die? I guess the kappa becomes too large. I can just yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna go toxic deluge. They can just attack Tamio. Yeah, let's just go toxic deluge. Ah, 
I mean, you did your job. You made a you made a clue token. Yeah, flipping a comp. Tamiya doesn't accomplish anything flipping. This is good. Bonjour, Otashi. Oh, oh, sorry. You're saying goodbye to Tamiya. All right. Yeah. Adios. Well, we say ciao to greet somebody arriving. When they leave, we say ciao. No, but uh, <laughs> I guess. Yeah. Yeah, we don't really have a goodbye. Well, arri arrivederci. We can say arrivederci. Arrivederci. Which means um, see, 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 see you later. Which literally means a arrivederci. Anyway, um, boo, I don't know. I'm not gonna lose this game. I'm not gonna lose this game. <sighs> Let's go, Pollute Delta. Fetch. Yeah, basic island. Push froggy. Pay the ward. Wanna go preordain or crack clue? It's probably mana inefficient, but I have like a lot of one drops, so I'm just gonna go preordain. I I have a lot of one drops. Like this. I told you about it. Bona, that's true, we say Bona. But I guess that's not really a lesson though. Sometimes also Bella. Anyway, Kozilek's unsealing. Ay ay ay. If I played Arbinger, they wouldn't have been able to cast that thing. You wanna flip Tamio? Well, first, let's draw a card. Ooh, my, my beloved drown in that lock. Man, I feel like I'm gonna lose the Kozlex on ceiling. I don't know about you, but I'm scared. I'm very scared, chat. I'll let you, I'll uh, remove you a land a mana. So you can cast a seven drop. No. You can't cast a seven drop right now, thankfully. Because it costs four and you don't have four because it arbinger your land. Babini. I mean, we're, we're here. I feel like I'm gonna lose this game, though. I don't have a good feeling about this game. Kozik and Ceiling just... It, it, it's not, uh, Kozik and Ceiling is just easily gonna take over this game. Merda. Via. Toxic Deluge. Attenzione. Toxic Deluge may be a different story, though. It may be a different story. She got top. Ah, okay. That's fine. That doesn't do anything. Yeah, counter this. No, by the way, I have the answer. So when you say goodbye, we say ciao ciao twice. That's it. Ciao once is when they arrive. Ciao ciao is when you leave. That's the official. That's the official Italian lesson. For you, who didn't ask. All right. Um, what do I? I want to Tamio back the drown. No, I want to attack here. I want to attack here. I want to play a one mana five six. Man, where's, where's Orkish Bowmaster? Did I side it out? Oh, that's what I want. Okay, okay, I got it. I'll minus three, because I want to find Orkish Bowmaster. So I'll get back Preordain. Die, Bowmaster. So that Kozak's and Ceilings if I'm on Belculo. No, 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 no. Orkish Bowmaster, now. Oh, thanks you. That's down, not bad. Uh, what if I crack a clue? Let's crack it. Mm hmm. I should have cracked the clue. Maybe I shouldn't have cracked the clue. Yeah. I should have just played these and hold up press down. Press down that a good combo, by the way. Ciao. Va bene.
Attack for seven. Make a clue. What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I feel like my opponent has a seven drop, so yeah, we'll draw three. I definitely want to play Frog. Frog is lethal next turn. I'll play Frog. Frog is incredible. And I'll pass. I can dress down if they have top monitor. DB Mangu wins the match. All right, we only lost to Mono, Mono Red Storm so far. And the matchup against Storm shouldn't even be that bad. I guess game one, we got stumbled on one land and almost won anyway. Game two, I think game two, opponent just, just killed me. Just killed me dead. This league is lasting a little bit more than the last one, but for the next week, I plan on streaming for three leagues a day, not two leagues a day, so a little bit longer. Match two at all inizio. Okay, I need to cut the burn video that's going out this afternoon. That we recorded earlier. What's my favorite MH three deck so far? As in decks with the most cards? It's probably this. I like this deck the best. All right, man. This deck is definitely. I want to play more lands in this deck. I feel like I got call mana screwed a lot. This hand has so many good cards, I don't want to mulligan it. I just feel so bad to mulligan in magic. But like, I can go survey land here. Nah, it's okay, I'll mulligan. Alright. Let him mulligan. Keep. Let's go. I'll keep a third land. No, I don't I don't think that shot is a good card. I don't think you need it. It's so nice to just have literally underground sea in your deck. Alright, what if I keep Merc Tide? Maybe. Maybe not. Man, your first message here in my chat is to complain about the ads. That's gonna be also your last, my friend. You will you greet into my con into my chat, into my store with that? That's it. Alright. Um I think I'll pollute the delta because I may want to go counter spell here. Okay. Counter, whatever you got. Counter. Oh, I can't counter that. Managa teva. Okay. Okay, well played. Well played, opponent. I'll give you that. Well played. Otsies. I'll play Thoughtsies. I know it's not great, especially since this swamp will literally be like a wasted land for the rest of the game. The Lotus Petal, basically. Play with fire, make a castle the castle. Alright, let's take that 
and pass. We play with fire. The next deck I'll play is Red Green Eldrazi. When I drew a fetch land and played it. Raw Mishra's Bubble. Hmm. Uh, let me go Preordain. I still have Drain in the Lock, which counters and kills. Best of card will Drain in the Lock. Never go if, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, I don't want that. I will draw the Nether go if. How big is it? It's a 1 mana 3 4. It's alright. I like it. I like a 1 mana 3 4. Do, 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 do. In modern? No, no. In modern affinity, you can't play two colors. You barely can play one color. The red green Eldrazi. We gotta play the new Eldrazis. I'm excited to try that. Le oh! No, vabbè, chat! They surveilled Flage in the graveyard. Si, vabbè, ma chi sei? And next turn I can cast it. Si, vabbè, ma te. I'll put a rig the, the, the program over there. They. I didn't cut. I didn't cut, and they put Flage on top of the deck. Chat. Judgy. Judgy, my opponent didn't make me cut the deck. I played a league with this card, and literally never drew it. I drew it once, <laughs> and it was just lightning Enix. Attenzione, they're playing a slick shot from the Exile effect. From the Exile zone. <laughs> Got it. Uh, it has to resolve. I mean, not that. It doesn't matter. I can kill it or counter it. Actually, if they... I spent because if they flash this back, I can't drown in the locket. Man, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I have to drown in the lock this. Otherwise, I'm, I'm go, I go, go. No, I can't believe... I can't believe they surveilled us in the graveyard. I can't believe it. I had to drown in the lock, otherwise this card is dead. <laughs> yeah, I might have was I, I told you about that swamp. It was my probably a mistake. Alright, now you you got their flage. And into top deck. Otherwise, this card kills me. Man, I can never believe to lose this game. This game looked unlosable. Only this card could have won the game. Honestly, this is a better video for Flage than my my actual burn video with Flage was. I, I just, you know, I played a league with that deck and this card was never relevant. Because I never drew it. And I play against it one game and it's insane. Yeah. I'm honestly a believer of this card. I think it's the downside of just making your Lightning Elix cost one more. It's not too big compared to the fact that you just have a Titan in, in your deck, in your burn deck. Push. Push was a great draw, man. Good way I look at. So well played, well played. Hello. Um, unfortunately, I don't have uh, the revolt, but obviously I can uh, enable it by by chump blocking it. But the thing is that I go to seven and they have uh, seven damage, so I'm dead. I have no outs. The attack. I guess they may shot. They may shoot the psychic frog, maybe. Yeah. That's go that's gonna be my way to hope to win this game. If they shoot my psychic frog, I can then trigger revolt. No, I don't like Star with Denial. Uh va bene, basta, basta. I am now very dead. Flage. Mm 
The nuts, the 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 bari, the strawberries. All right, would you like to play first? Yes, I would. Thank you. Would you like to keep this end? Yes, I would. Thank you. I'm all to six. Okay, what do we do now? Oh, uh, do I want to surveil? Nah, sorry, do I want to play Prioridate? Nah, I probably just want to go survey land, I think. Yeah, I just want to do that only. Sewer, surveil. I love underground sea. Love to draw underground sea. Thank you. Do I just go psychic frog and load? I, I will. I'll go psychic frog and just discard everything to it, like I did against Merfolk. One card combo, psychic frog. You open two flaging what pre release? Nice. I also opened flage as my promo pre release. Why marsh flats over a blue fetch? Because we have Harbinger of the Seas, so I need to fetch a swamp. And love it art on me. Wow, why? Why you do that? Skewer critics. Light of the stage. Yeah. All right. Saki frog. How big do you want to become? Probably not too big. I just attack and pass. Yeah, I don't need to to do anything crazy. Just get my Dredger Arcanus going. Dread of Arcane is disbanded in Legacy because it does exactly this. Tax draw card. Um free. Okay, um now Death Swiss Spear, which have push. I play another frog. And just can't even block the Swiss Spear, honestly. We'll see. You got to invert polarity, cause this command x equal five? Whoop. Sweet. You wanna cast Merc Tide here? Unfortunately, in the game of magic, you have to follow its rules. I would love to cast Merc Tide. But this card is a steep cost to pay. Not that steep, actually. What you do there? <gasps> oh, I see what you wanted to do. You wanted to discard all my cards and play Merc? Oh, that's too big brain. I'm too afraid of doing that play. No. Actually, it may be a good play, though. Man, how do you ever lose a game with Frog? How can you ever lose a game with this card? Turn to Frog against a red deck. Too good. Simply too good. No, I think that's too extreme. I don't want to. I don't want to. I, 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 it's just impossible to lose here. All 
Alright, so you're playing show off. I think I counter. I know I've pushed for it, but the Swiss Bear is also scary. So I wanted to have counter spell and push. Yeah, fraud, fraud's great. Tommy! Thank you, Tommy. You're welcome. Alright, I'll block. What you do? You bold who? The frog? No, 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 non provasa. Let's discard a card, put a plus one, plus one. Discard a card, put a plus one, plus one. And neither go if it's a five, six, by the way. Chasenti. Chalutite. Who do you bolt now? My frog again. All right, I think it's time for my frog to die. My frog ate two lightning bolt. All right, frog, you did a, you did a great job. We will remember you. Who is still as love at art? You love that the Nether Goeth. I'll finally push that Swiss Spear. Yeah, I'm glad I countered the the show off. I would have like lost the game if I not lost the game. I don't think I would have lost this game, but I would have been in a tough spot. Now it was obviously over this turn. Okay, game three, final game of this league. This league has gone well so far. Definitely had a a good run. Lost to Mono Red Storm. Maybe we can lose this match as well, but we'll see. Do I want Harbinger of the Seas? Maybe not. Yeah, let me have Stern Scolding instead. On the play, maybe it's okay. But on the draw, I prefer having uh, Stern Scolding. Is Fossil Storm in the set, actually? Like, can you draft it? Alright, my hand is a one lander, but the one land is an underground sea, so I'm gonna keep it. Fountain, DRC. Did you mulligan? No, you didn't. Okay, I... I'd want to bubble myself and do that little bubble thing. I don't think so. I don't think so. I think I just want to play Shores and just cycle. I want to keep up the option of going Scalding, Stern Scalding or Push. I'm just happy to cycle. I don't need to get opt. Plus, like, probably. I mean, obviously there's, like, bad cards to draw, like a second counter spell. You go play with fire? Play with fire. Alright, you scry one, I guess. Oh, you left the land on top. Oh, because you only have one land. I see. Nice, another underground, see? When you're against burn and you draw a double of this land, feels good. Feels very good. Skew at a crit dex. Now we go push. Yeah, I think the, the op here. Alright. I feel good about this game. This is 
an exclamation mark lose game, I feel. We have all we need. Okay, uh, I want to play Nethergoev, but I want it not to die to Bolt. I have to fetch first. And... I may fetch Island. Yeah, I think... I'll... Oh, you... yeah, I'll do this. I'll go Polluted Delta. And I'll play Nethergoev. Now, if they fetch, I can just start to Bolt it. Obviously, I fetch, so they will never Bolt it. And I can also, this way, get the Survey Land. We lost to Sir Ruby Storm. Yes, we lost to we lost to Ruby Storm. They go show off. Oh, they plotted. My bad. I don't care. I don't care if you plot it. Oh, this is your Tamio, inquisitive student. Tamio fought me by the ball cancel. Tamio so good. But not now. Graveyard, grow the goif. Oh, the frog. Okay, what about now? The frog. Do I go frog? Then you go some scolding on the shot on the show off. If you have another one, though, you get me. If you have another one, you get me. I don't want to get go. I feel like I can never lose this game. So let's just play safe, and I can't lose it. My 14, it took one damage from my lands, and I have three dual land in play. Counter. Us, all right, let's play this thing at the end, which is bad, don't get me wrong, but just the fact that you can, like, hold up counter and play a threat is what's nice about the orc. Okay, now I'm gonna go Psychic Frog. And actually, I wanna discard Preordain pre combat so I grow my Goyf to a 5 6. And I deal 7, so you're dead into attacks. You're bolting the frog. As they say a Roma, sti cazzi. Et attacco. Buongiorno Terlolito, we're about to 4-1 with 4 drawn in the lock deck. No, Lava Dart. Alright, never mind. My opponent doesn't want to die, so they will survive one more turn here. I've never reanimated the Nettergoyf so far in the... Um, I want to think about some changes to the deck. One mana, five, six. Who needs to play that shadow? To play a big threat nowadays. Yeah, the Goyf has escaped. Yeah, frog and that. Yeah, no, this deck they definitely tested together. Like they definitely, like the deck that I put together right now feels like a very much a intro deck, Modern Horizons three, where you know the clear best cards of the set you can put them all together. Like Tamio, Nethergoyf, Psychic Frog. You can also now. Nah, I'm not a believer of Necrodominance, but you can do that if you want to put Grief and Necrodominance instead. You don't feel like Nethergoyf and Merc that is a Nombo. That's not true though, because Channeler only cares about four types. Nethergoyf, I think it's it's a little bit more than that. Torrent, what are you doing? You want to see me play Commander on Car Market? I did. We played old school Commander. 
That video has a lot of views too. All right. Uh, okay, so things I want to change to the deck. I want to add a 20th land. I want to add a 20th land. Um, what does it have to be? Probably a fetch land, because it's like the most boring answer possible. And the card I want to cut, maybe it's just a drown. You probably don't need it. No, don't need four drown. Three. The new bloat land. Well, I have it already. Sink into stupor. Actually, I don't. I don't like. I want to add the uh, regular marsh floods. Thank you. Yeah, and I cut run in the lock. Yeah. Yeah. No, this deck's great. It is uh, my best deck of MH three at the moment. All the cards, all the three cards, all the three new cards today overperformed. And uh, I'm excited about it. And again, we lost to Ruby Storm, but it doesn't seem like this matchup should be bad against it. This this deck should be alright against that deck. If that deck becomes like a, a very good deck, you can just add more new spell bomb. And you just you know, can never lose. I mean not can never lose, but if you have spell bomb in play, they can kill it with Past in Flame, so they have to kill you through like card advantage. Which obviously is something that they can do, but you also have pressures and you know. Surgical Extraction is for you. I, I don't play Surgical Extraction, but you know, a lot of people love it, so. Arbiter of the Sea still remains to be seen how good it is. I haven't played against any Eldrazi deck, so. In the previous league I did with Burn, I played against two Eldrazi decks. Speaking of which, I'm about to play Eldrazi, but if you're watching this video, and if you watch this video on YouTube, make sure to subscribe. There's a lot of modern videos coming up. Thank you, thank you.